Hi, it's Kathy, and this video is about Navigate Program Fit. So one of the very frequently asked questions that we get is, I'm a non-tenure track faculty, or I'm a postdoc, or I'm a PhD student, and I'm not sure if Navigate is for me. So I wanna address that right now so that you totally understand um, how the program works and whether it is a good fit for you or not. So when we talk about Navigate, we're often speaking to people in tenure track jobs. The reason for that, tenure track or equivalent, we have plenty of people internationally that also, you know, don't use the word tenure, but it's a similar kind of on the way to permanent um, position that they're in. Now, the reason that we talk like that is that the program was designed for somebody who has some control over their schedule. So even if you're like early career, if you're on the tenure track, maybe not, you know, in your first year, even you might be shy about asking for schedule changes or about holding boundaries. But um, we know that it is more accessible to hold boundaries for people in a tenure track line than it might be for people in a non tenure track line. Um, if you're a postdoc, if you're a researcher, or if you're a PhD student, that doesn't mean it's impossible. It just means that we recognize that your agency over your schedule is at least culturally feels more powerful um, when you are in a tenure track or permanent line. That is a belief system, right? And what we want to show you inside of our program is that you have agency to enact changes over your schedule and to enforce boundaries on your time and to make choices that go in favor of you rather than you know doing what the institution needs you to do or tells you to do all the time. So, but I just want people, people who come in to navigate and are successful are like aware that even if they are a researcher and not in a tenure track line, that they are, they feel like they are ready to make hard choices about their time, to clear out things that don't go in service of their academic mission and to, and to really kind of step into that agency. So the line that you're in or the title of your job for Navigate is not important. We're not checking anybody's papers at the door. This is really like, if you are ready to make the kinds of changes that are going to allow you to put writing at the center, then come on in. So we've had postdocs, we've had PhD students, especially late stage PhD students. It's not really a, dis it's not a dissertation writing program. So I would say if you're a PhD student on the cusp of graduating, that that's probably a better fit than someone early stage who's still doing coursework. So, so in some cases we've had late stage PhD students do navigate. We've had researchers, we've had non-tenure track faculty who are like, I am just, I wanna, take control of what I'm doing and I want to get my publications out because that's the way that you're going to get the tenure track line if that's what you're going for. So all of those people have taken our program and been very successful. So it's not that you can't be successful in Navigate um, if you don't have a tenure track line. It's that I want people to understand that the kinds of things that we're going to teach you how to do involve you really owning your power and agency inside of your institution. And um, we're going to support you as you develop that. Um, we're going to help you to, to, um, to develop that. And also we acknowledge that even if you're in a tenure track, tra tenure track line, but you're a minority scholar or a minoritized scholar, then it absolutely feels different in terms of how you can enact that agency. We have, as part of our Navigate program, we run a BIPOC circle. So that's a, um, a special monthly call led by Thea, our coach who is trained in um, diversity, equity, and inclusion. And Thea runs a call for our BIPOC scholars where you get to talk specifically and get support specifically um, for, you know, in a community of other minority and minoritized folks. So um, if you have doubts about whether Navigate is right for you, it really doesn't matter as much your line 
your tenure track or permanent line. It matters your willingness to say like, I'm gonna take control of what's happening. I'm gonna drive my career. I'm gonna make decisions. I'm gonna hold boundaries. We teach you how to do all of those things. You have to be ready and in a position to actually follow through with it. Because if you're not, then all the advice you're gonna be like, oh, I wish I could do that, but I'm non-tenured. Or I wish I could do that, but I'm just a, in a research line. So if that's your thinking, then maybe Navigate isn't the best fit for you because I need your thinking to be open to the fact that you are powerful in your situation, that you do have agency and that you can make choices that support your academic mission statement and drive your career in the direction that you want it to go. So I hope that clarifies things. Take care. Bye.